of new trailers, the first official trailer for the new Hugh Jackman and Taron Edgerton, star of this year's Kingsman The Secret Service film, Eddie the Eagle has just landed. Produced by Matthew Vaughn, the film follows Edgerton as Eddie Edwards. <coughs> Edwards became a national hero by becoming the first Olympic first competitor to represent Great Britain in Olympic ski jumping during the 1988 Winter Olympics in Calgary. He was a particular dark horse to achieve this placement since he had no funding and his farsightedness forced him to wear glasses under his goggles, making him virtually blind during the jumps. The press nicknamed Edwards Mr. Magoo, and even though he placed last in the 70 meter and 90 meter ski jumping events, he was, millimeter, <laughs> he was hailed as a heroic failure. Jackman plays Chuck Berghorn, a ski expert who helped Edwards train for the games, while Christopher Walken plays Berghorn's own mentor. Schnapp, buy or sell this new trailer for Eddie the Eagle. Hey, it's a giant buy for me. You guys know how what a big sports fan I am. Well, this, <laughs> this kind of trailer and this kind of movie is something that uh, someone like me challenged with glasses my entire life. I really got a kick out of it. And the, when you put goggles on or when you put 3D glasses on when you're already wearing glasses, that's a whole world of different irritations and pain, especially if you're wearing goggles in snow. So like that shot of him, like with all the broken glasses, that, that was me as a kid when I was playing sports mm. as a young kid, like, you know, breaking glasses constantly, bro, like tape, tape in the middle. Right. But anyway, aside I got from news that, for everybody. That's still John Schnepp. I know. Yeah. But uh, <laughs> you know what? I love this trailer. It was really fun to see like the underdog just not giving up enough. And, and, and you Jackman, just such a role that like, I love when Hugh Jackman plays this kind of a role. He's only done it a few times, but he's a natural at it. So everything in this movie feels like it's a really fun, uh, fun film. So I'm, it's a big buy for me. Christian? I'm going to buy it as well, too, and I'm going to stick with the theme that I've been doing this whole show, and that's another actor who's doing different things. Yeah, Look totally. at Edgerton. That, I mean, Egerton. What a smart move for this kid to do this because he's unrecognizable. And no, you totally. put side by side with the real Eddie the Eagle. He looks just like him with the, with the mustache and all that. And the story is great. It's a great story. The guy was terrible, but he didn't stop, and he kept going. He kept trying. He almost broke his neck a hundred times, but he kept going and competing, and came in last all the time. But it didn't matter. And I think that that kind of that that story is is going to be incredible to watch, especially with Hugh Jackman being that mentor. Although I didn't see walking in the trailer. Did he? Did he, he pop one in? second. One the second. Very last very thing. Brief, he's yeah. hugging it out with Hugh Jackman. Oh. I'm like, that's oh, Chris okay. for walking. You know, I was like, that's so weird. To ski. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but, I, but I think that. Uh, yeah, I, I'm. I'm really I'm interested. In, also, because Matthew Vaughn is producing it as well, too. It doesn't it, matter if you laugh. It doesn't matter, Vaughn. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> That's my thoughts. <laughs> uh, I buy this trailer huge. Like being it, those Olympics were in Calgary, so they're in Canada. And I remember as a kid, like Eddie the Eagle was a phenomenal. Like everybody mm. just rallied. This this guy who had no business being in the Olympics, but had the right to represent his country and do it. And everybody, I just remember everybody going nuts for him and cheering for him. And then you see to see the background story of this guy. I love stories of ordinary people who summon the guts and the testicular fortitude to do extraordinary things. Yeah, mm -hmm. And this is just a great story. And because it's not just a great story about him and what he did, it's also a great story. It's a type of story that gives me hope in humanity because it's also about people who rallied around this guy to help him do mm -hmm. his dream. And not just the Hugh Jackman character, whatever, but also, you know, the audiences and the fans. And, and his mom. And, his, and yeah. his family. Like, just movies like this, I love seeing. There aren't enough of them, so I completely buy yeah. it. Hey guys, if you like this clip, click here to watch the entire episode. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, because it'll help you stay up to date with all the stuff we've got going on here at Collider.